In this video, I'm going to show you how to make chords. So the first thing we want to do is just to load up a simple FL keys. You can use any kind of sound. I like to make chords in a simple piano and then later switch them to the kind of sound I want. But that's up to you. The first thing you want to do when building some simple chords is to start by finding four bass notes. So a bass note is just one note like this one and you just want to find four notes that just sound good so i'm just going to start placing four notes for my chords Okay, so I like the sound of these four notes. And uh, by the way, a tip for you, if you would like to have some help, you can go up to this uh, left corner and under helpers, go into scale highlighting and select automatic. So when you select this, uh, as long as you just put in notes where they are gray, like you can see the lighter ones, it will make sure that all the notes you write in is in key with the song, so nothing will sound out of key. So the next step is to copy. So the way I copy is you can either go up to the top and select the selection tool, or you can just uh, hold control with the pencil and then drag like this. And then I shift, left click and drag to duplicate. And what you wanna do is to uh, copy take these notes and move them up seven steps so one two three four five six seven like this so this creates uh, the second note of our simple chords now the first step is to add in the middle notes so just adding these notes in between And I just select these where they are white. I'm going to move this one up. So now we have actually already built a simple uh, chord pattern right here. So this is the kind of the most basic form of chords with only three notes placed like this. The next thing we can do to uh, just kind of spice them up a little bit, make them sound a bit more interesting. We can do actually a few things. So uh, one thing we can start doing is select all these middle notes that we just placed by holding shift and then left click and then control and then up arrow to move them up one octave. So this just spreads the chord out uh, more, which I like the sound of. But this all depends on the sound you want. So I like these uh, more spread out. And then what you can do is just add some extra notes in between or above or whatever. So I'm just going to, to place the notes where the gray area and just try out the different placements and see where it sounds good. So this is what we've ended up. I don't really want to add anything extra to these chords. Uh, I think they sound really good. So now I've taken the chords that I made to begin with and I've put it into a little beat. Now already just with the chords and the notes we've made, we get something that sounds like this. Mm -hmm. 